Welcome to Sunshine Art and Drawing. Today I'm going to be doing a watercolour painting of Peter Rabbit. It is a bit of a Easter tradition for me. I like to do a bit of Peter Rabbit every Easter. Here I'm just sizing the paper. It's where you place water on the paper and allow it to dry to try and get the paper to flatten out a bit and be a bit easier to paint. And the next part is just smoothing it out a bit. This paper was pretty wrinkled so um, I had to tape it down pretty hard. And I'm just going to pull out all my colours and decide what colours to use. Um, I have three sets of tube paints. Um, one of them is a Mikador set, one of them is Derwent, and the other one is um, like a cheap pro art brand I got from a cheap store. A lot of the pro art ones are pretty dried out, so I end up just using some Derwent ones and some Mikador ones. And this is probably the best thing to do when you're using tube um, watercolour, is to mix each one with water, maybe on a palette or on a spare bit of paper, and test it out, because as you can see, even though that it's supposed to be the same colour, the outside colour of the tube on the paint are different, even though the colour is pretty similar. So it's always helpful to do a few swatches. Um, I'm going through all of my browns to see if I can figure out what would be the best colours to use. And I end up using um, a burnt umber, a burnt sienna, and yellow ochre. And I'll pop in the middle the paints that I use um, as I've chosen them. So as you can see, there's two Mikador paints sitting there in the middle. And I end up choosing to use an ultramarine blue for his jacket and the Derwent Crimson Red to do um, the nose and the ears with a little bit of white to make it pink. Which I pop the white there. And in the greens I choose um, a sap green for the light colour of the grass and then also a viridian hue for the darker colour in the grass like the shadows. And for the gold buttons I use um, a gold acrylic paint that I have. And here I'm just going to bring it up a little bit closer just to show you um, the different ones that I'm going to choose. And those are the paints in the centre. So here I'm just going to do um, all of the colours around my little palette. And once I've done that and shown you the different colours I'm going to be using, I will just label them going from the 12 o'clock position as I add water to each one. So we're going crimson red in a Derwent and ultramarine blue in Derwent and then we've got sap green and viridian hue at the bottom and then yellow ochre and burnt sienna and also black and white and in the middle on the left I've mixed a bit of the burnt sienna and a bit of the yellow ochre together. Now I've done a bit of a sketch already of this picture so I know what I'm going to do. Come back at the end of this video and I'll let you know what I'm going to be doing next week. See you in a little bit.
So this is my finished artwork. I used a bit of gold as you can see for a few of the highlights and there's his little face. I hope you enjoyed this video. I really like painting Peter Rabbit and it's a bit of an Easter tradition for me. So I hope you um, try some painting yourself. Maybe do a bit of craft. Next week watch out for my video because I'll be doing some Easter cards that you can make yourself to give to friends and family. I hope you have a sunshiny day. Thanks so much for watching.